Hi everybody, this is Andrew again with another update on Monster vs. Player. Uh, today I wanted to show the uh, the new stage that I added to the uh, the set. It's It was actually super easy to migrate the assets that were in our demo scene into this, uh, this new demo scene. And um, just wanted to show you how the interactions are still there and work just as how they did before. So our deployment area is actually this this small area here. I still need to sort of light that up somehow to identify that this is the area you should click if you want to place your units. But we'll just go ahead and put a, a few units out there before we run up run up gold or uh, dungeon points. So we have our, our three um, three units and then there's still the paladin and still the peasant. Um, those will change, but for now that's that's what it is. I'm going to, let's say, move one of these guys out and and turn. If you notice the, yeah, we're not there yet. If you notice the um, Paladin character is going to be able to uh, start coming up the steps, which I thought would have been much harder than what it was, um, but we're definitely uh, chugging along with that. And it moves back to our um, ghost. I'm going to move probably right here and prepare for his radius, um, but not actually get in range of him. I probably didn't need these other two guys to, to hang out. Um, so let's get him a little closer. Yep, he's not attacking me yet. And let's get him a little closer. Yeah, other than that, the uh, the game remains mostly the same. Uh, I did go ahead and change the camera out. Uh, this, so this is a, um, an, I guess, a non-standard camera. And uh, it follows the character around a little bit. I can show you that. If I, if I move over here, uh, move here, move, please. Oh, maybe it just didn't change the icon. So it follows the camera, the, the character around, I think on a, more consistent basis than what was there before. I'll go ahead and then turn. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to really do anything with these other two guys yet, if anything. Um, all right, so he's going to move closer. Our peasant would move closer now, and let's go ahead and get over there and kill that peasant because he's got the lowest hit points of all. Let's just give him a. We're not in range of the melee. Okay. Oh, actually, we we are. That's um that's interesting. Let's just apply that attack and, and turn. So yeah, we, we hit a we hit an object reference error. That's fine. Um it's because there was multiple things to dispose and it couldn't dispose them. Um so that that's fine, right? The the main thing is that I wanted to show that the uh, new stage is out here. And this is the uh, this is the demo for what what I'd like to pitch as like this vertical slice of what this game is gonna be. Um, so a couple of things that are interesting about this one, you'll notice that the, uh, like I said, the cameras change. I'm not going to drill down into the, in the asset view. Um, another thing I wanted to show was that, um, navigation, I had to work a little bit with navigation. So the, the blue area is the really the area that you can walk around and do things in. Um, obviously we, even though this block might be the same, um, prefab structure as these blocks, these are things that we wanted to exclude from being able to navigate to. So if there's a path between enemy and player and player and a point that you click on, that's really how they're going to determine on how to get to the next place they're going. But um, overall, I think, you know, I'm, I'm pretty happy with this update and uh, I'm going to keep iterating on it from here. Um, you know, I, I'm really not even sure what's next. Maybe we add a spell, maybe we start to um, add critical boxes on the backs of these guys so that if they do catch a catch a spell or a, a strike in the back that it's actually, you know, maybe a 1.5, 1.25 damage multiplier to bring in more of the, the strategy component of what makes this game a strategy RPG. Um, other than that, yep, it's just a real quick short video. I wanted to show the progress update and um, I think the next one will be out in a, a few more days and we'll see what else, uh, what else I end up adding to it in the meantime. All right. Thanks everybody. Thanks for watching. Um, also, if you have any critiques or comments I'm would be super interested in hearing those um, put those in the in the comments below or reach out to me on uh, the Facebook page um, other than that thanks for watching and uh, have a great day bye